First, I'm going to show you how to install the door slash window sensor. The sensor is made up of two parts, the sensor side, which is the large piece, and the magnet side, which is the smaller piece. The first thing we're gonna do is peel off the backing off the 3M tape and then apply it to the magnet side. Next, I'll apply it to the sensor. Now the way these are installed is that one side sticks onto the frame of the door and the other side sticks onto the actual door itself. For aesthetic reasons, the smaller side will look better on the door, but depending on the type of frame you have, the smaller side may fit better on the frame instead. So you can place either side of the sensor on the door or the frame. Before installing the sensor, here are a few tips you should pay close attention to which will help avoid any connection problems or reading errors. Number one, install these near the top of the door as this will help to avoid the sensor from being accidentally torn off by someone or something. Also, because the tab to open the sensor cover is at the bottom, having the sensor placed higher will make it easier for you when you need to replace the battery in the future. Number two, ensure the arrows on both the sensor side and the magnet side are aligned perfectly. Number three, make sure both sides of the sensor are less than one quarter inch apart. And number four, if you have an uneven door frame, you can strategically layer additional double-sided 3M tape or corrugated plastic until both sides of the sensors are perfectly flat, as you can see here. Once you've decided where you want to install the sensor, remove the 3M backing off one side of the sensor. I'll do the sensor side first, which is the large side. Then apply it to the door or the frame, whichever side works best for you. In this situation, as you can see here, the door frame is too uneven and does not allow room for the large side. Place it about a few millimeters from the edge. Then we'll remove the backing off the magnet side. And as you can see here, there's just enough room for it to fit on the frame. Again, make sure that the arrow on the magnet side aligns with the arrow on the sensor side. Now let's do a test and open the door. As soon as you open the door, a red light should turn on for a few seconds. As you can see, everything works perfectly. To install the sensor on a window, it's done exactly the same as installing on the door. However, many windows are designed to open differently. So just keep in mind that as long as both sides of the sensor are aligned perfectly, then the sensor will work. Here's an example of a sensor being installed on a typical basement window. You now know how to install the contact sensor on your door or your window. Well, we hope this video helped you out. And if it did, please give us a big thumbs up. If you have any questions, just drop us a comment below. And if you wanna see more videos, don't forget to subscribe. All the products that you see on our channel are available with free shipping at osigoldirect.com or amazon.com. Those links are provided in the description below. My name is Brandon Paris, and thank you for watching.